Hello guys and girls and peoples, it's Stefan again. Um, you know, I thought since there's, since a, the movie came out just recently, I thought I'd do Let's Play the, the SNES game. That's right, you're doing Yogi Bear real quick. Um, I'm also going to be doing, like I said earlier in another video, I said I was going to do Super Mario World again. Uh, and I am going to do that before I go to bed tonight, so, um, uh, just letting you guys know. Anyways, Snow Business, Stage 1. Um, I checked all the buttons, no buttons work except for the D-pad and A, which is jump. Uh, pretty much this is, from what I can tell, is a collecting, uh, mission, you know, game, so far, um, you collect stopwatches for time clocks, picnic baskets, uh, which Yogi obviously is known for, and, the, as you can see, there's little blue flower type thingies, uh, you're supposed to pass out with those stuff, um, so, yeah. Um, and you have all these enemies on here. So far, we've seen rabbits and snowman. Um, and there I fall off because I slid off because I slipped. Um, so, yay. First death this early. Yay for death in games. Yeah, right. Alright, anyways. Back to the action, which there is not much of. <coughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, you you get hit and you lose a piece of your health, which is believe it or not, that piece of cake down in the lower right hand corner. Now with this game, and I found this out real early, and I do not like it at all, is the fact that there is no like Mario games and some other in a bunch of other games. No actual, you know, no hit detection thing where you hit something, you hit an enemy, and you don't get like two seconds of being invisible or a second of being invisible. You can automatically get hit again. Yeah, real good. Um, so. Um, now at the beginning, I don't know if you guys actually saw this or not, but at the beginning intro thing, it said that, that the ga you know, when the game was made, and by who was in it, and the names and stuff like that, it said that, it said Yogi Bear, Boo Boo, Ranger, uh, I forgot the guy, shoot, I forgot the Ranger's name already, um, Ranger Smith, I believe, I, I'm probably way off. Anyways, um, those two, at least from what I've seen so far, and I played through this a little bit, at least I tried to, um, I don't see Boo Boo anywhere in this. Um, at least I, I don't think, maybe I haven't gotten far enough to see Boo Boo yet, and I haven't seen Ranger Smith yet. And so, um, I don't know what's going on. Why, why say the names if you're, if maybe they're not in the game? I don't know. Um, anyways, I'm sure, really not sure what the timers, the little time clocks do, or if they're supposed to mean anything at all. <coughs> Um, obviously the picnic baskets mean something because that's, I mean, that's Yogi's thing. He is, you know, as we all know, smarter than the average bear and, um, decide, you know, steals picnic baskets. I mean, that's the whole, you know, premise, the whole reason for the show, uh, the old cartoon and everything, you know. Him and Boo Boo acting goofy and 
try to steal picnic baskets. That's how it was. So, um, and yes, I do. I, I really miss the old cartoons, but um, this game right now is not, you know, really that great. <laughs> um, yeah, I fall down right before the end of the level. Um, yeah, I'm good. I'm really good at this game. Um. This, you know, this is another game that kind of has, uh, gives me a little bit of a problem just because of the fact that there's no, um, I, let's just, well, let's just say I have a real big problem with games that don't have stories. Not that I, I'm not saying I don't like games that don't have stories or backstories to them, um, but... You know, maybe there's gotta be, I mean, there's gotta be some reason why, uh, you know, things are going on. I mean, you know, nobody's just gonna be like, hey, I'm, you know, all these animals are gonna be doing stuff to you and work, they hate you or something or whatever. You know, I don't understand that. I really don't understand why. I mean, not that it, having or not having a storyline in a game makes it good or bad. You know, I mean, like take games like let's see, I'm trying to think of a game that didn't have a storyline that was per, that was good. Um, and you guys can correct me if I'm wrong, and I probably will be on some of these. But um, well, like okay. Games that had that were really good that had storylines, obviously like Metal Gear Solid or Final Fantasy, those kind of games. Those games always have storylines or backstories too. And look at how you know Metal Gear Solid's got like eight titles or something. I don't know in the whole series. And Final Fantasy's got 13 so far, not including the Game Boy Advance games. Um, you know, they're, uh, just a bunch of games that I, I can't even think of any right now that don't have storylines that are really good. I know a lot of games that are really bad that don't have storylines, like Casper for one, for the SNES Casper. I recently did a Let's Play of. Um, yeah. No story at all, didn't tell you what you're supposed to be doing while you're there, or anything like that. And, personally, I didn't like the game. You know, call me bad, or whatever you want to call me for not liking a game because it doesn't have a story. But I just, I just think it would help that to have a storyline to a game. So you can at least know, hey, you know, this is why main character A is doing whatever instead of like hey we're gonna pop you right in there and not tell you exactly what's going on now <clears throat> I mean you know probably it probably says something in the instruction manual to these games and to, you know Casper and Yogi Bear here and you know but um I not only do I a not have the instruction manual, but b tend not to read. I haven't. I I, I don't think I've read an ins I really read an instruction manual to a video game since maybe Genesis. <laughs> I mean, I'm serious. You know, I really don't read the instruction manuals unless I need to. I mean, if there's not an option screen in the game. I'll read the instruction manual half the time, but that's just that. <laughs> so it's not like I read the instruction manuals. Not that they're, you know, hey, it's good that they're there, but you know, you can't always get to them. Anyways, um, so we're just cruising along here. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I'm trying to. Yeah, see that that's remember how I told you about earlier about the no you know, you get hit and then you can get hit automatically twice or more. Yeah, that there that happened there with those little I guess you call them what 
weasels or something. I don't know what they are. I mean, well, you don't. Find, I don't think you find weasels in the in the Jellystone Park or or wherever. Yeah. So, um, but anyways, that's what happened with that. That happens to me a lot, especially with the bunnies. Yeah, let me in real life I love bunnies. Yeah, you can call me whatever for that, but you know, but I, but I'm gonna go out and say I just love me a cute little bunny. So there. Ha huh, ha. Huh. And I don't care what you guys say. Is you know, if it's bad, go ahead and say it. I don't care. It's not like I'm gonna listen to you. So anyways, we're gonna try again. And by the way, you can get you can get to like the very end and then die like the last second before the end of the level and send you exactly back to the start. <laughs> so we got more of the uh, bad hit detection stuff with the bunnies and the snowman there. Um. So yeah. Um. Can, you know, as you can see, more. I'm, I'm trying to kind of just. I've kind of tried to herd through the game as much as I can. <coughs> kind of, kind of getting bored of the game. Kind of not sick of it, but just bored. Um, so I'm gonna go do. I'm gonna do uh, Super Mario World, and then attempt to do that level, those levels again. I think. That I think I'm way overdue for uh, beating a level in Super Mario World. I don't know why it's been giving me so many problems, but hey, I'll do it. I don't get it done this time. So I will see you guys at the Super Mario World video when I do it here in a minute or two. All right, peace out, guys. Hey, hey, hey.